Now back to the breaking news we first told you about at the beginning of this newscast. We told you on Wavy News 10 at 6, we sent several questions to Norfolk police after that officer involved shooting yesterday. And tonight we have answers to most of our questions. We know that officers were not wearing body cameras. We also now know that there will be two separate investigations, both of them though, internal done by the Norfolk police themselves. Tell on your sides, Matt Gregory has been working to get those questions answered. He joins us now in our newsroom with what other new details we have tonight. Matt? Brandy, we spent the weekend digging for answers from Norfolk police after that early morning shooting on Saturday. And tonight I talked to a spokesperson from Norfolk police and they gave us more details. We knew 25 year old India Beatty was shot by Norfolk narcotics officers. We asked police if the officers were undercover. The spokesperson says no. But the officers were in plain clothes, meaning they were in normal clothes, but wearing protective vests with the words police across the front. Now, we also asked if the two plain clothes officers had body cameras. I was told they do not. The department has been outfitting the field patrol officers first. The two officers are in an investigative unit, so they've not been outfitted yet. We also wanted to know who will conduct the investigation. Will it be external or will it be internal? I was told it will be two internal investigations, an administrative one by the Office of Professional Standards and a criminal investigation performed by Norfolk's homicide detectives. Police say the shooting happened in front of a restaurant on Shore Drive. They say the officers observed Beatty in an argument with a man and they claim she pulled out a gun. According to police, the officers told her to drop the weapon. They say she made a threatening motion, and that's when officers shot her. So I also asked, what threatening motion did India Beatty make that caused officers to shoot her? The Norfolk police spokesperson says at this point that information has not even been released to them, but they expect to be debriefed tomorrow and no more then. In the newsroom, Matt Gregory, 10 on your side.